Well, damn. Hey, good morning, everybody. Good damn morning and shit. So, this is the funny shit. I wake up to some fuckery. Okay, as, as usual. But I told the person that I was responding to live last night. This I told him this morning. Either you can choose to save this friendship that you ruined, or you can choose to crack in your crackhead boyfriend while you're married to your ugly while you're married to your ugly ass wife. His response, like a typical crackhead, I'm good. It's okay. Keep your crack. Okay, keep your drama. Because I'm over here in mine with no drama. Okay? You are my headache. You are my drama. So, I'm good. I'm single. I don't have to put up with. I won't put up with. I won't tolerate. I have no fucking filter. So, I'm good. And that's one thing I like about being live on Instagram. Mm Mm-hmm. I can save my fucking videos and upload them on my YouTube channel. And on my YouTube channel, I can name drop. I can say what the hell I have to say. So far. As long as it's not too vulgar. Because we all know I don't have a filter. So. You want to message me on Instagram because you don't have the balls to face me directly on my cell phone, which we all know I have two numbers. And a lot of people don't have that second number. Hell, a lot of people don't have my primary number. But anyway, I I put two and two together. You're hanging out with a homeless crackhead That's your best friend, all of a sudden. You give him the key to your car and you give him your cell phone. So you're sharing the crack. That's what I got. Because nobody with any type of self-worth dignity and self-respect would let a homeless crackhead have the key the only key to your car and your phone oh shit this is truly fuckery friday everybody Mm mm-hmm Damn, coffee damn near choked me. Um, yes, it is fuckery Friday. And I just want to say, I'm not here for it. Okay, I have to work. Okay, I have a life that I need to take care of. And I'm not here for the drama. Okay, I divorced drama. Okay. But then a friend all of a sudden has this new habit that you're trying to hide. Dude, you're not bright. You're not a strong-willed person. You give in to temptation. Oh, fighting temptations, bitch. Okay. So, you can't handle the stress and the drama that your family inflicts on you. You won't talk to me about it because I give you the actual factual truth and how to go about handling it. So that's too much for you. Okay? That's apparently that's too much for you. So what do you do? You find a homeless crackhead.
Where do we do that? And why? Where, number one. Two, why? The only time a person is going to befriend a crackhead is when they're on crack themselves or they are trying to be a part of the crack life. Now, I, I'm not a crackhead. I'm not a drug addict. I'm completely sober. But you want to befriend a crackhead, give him the key to your automobile that you're still paying for, and mm, mm, give him your cell phone. Now, you just got a new phone. You have a $1,300 phone. But you willingly hand over your phone to a crackhead. Let's give that a moment. Moment's done. Crackheads will steal anything they can to get that next high. But yet, you don't see that. Oh, I gave him a chance and he didn't do me wrong and yada, yada, yada. Crackheads will put up a good show until they get... But hold on. Th this is the part that kicks me in my face. You took the crackhead to where you live. It's not even your house. It's your wife's sister's house. So you took the crackhead to where you, you sleep. You're not right up here. There's a couple of nuts and bolts and gears and possible screws, um, springs that, that aren't connecting. They're just there. Not my problem. So when you end up no car, no phone, I don't want to say no job, but you know, if you keep doing what you're doing, you're, you're going to end up without a job. And even your boss, you took your words. You said to me that your boss said the exact same thing I said to you. I don't know your boss's name. I don't know what your boss looks like. I don't talk to your boss. I don't even know the boss's name. So there's no phone number. So do you catch on? No. Okay. So. Not my problem. Now you want to message me on Instagram. You have my number. But you want to turn into a whole bitch. And, oh my God, I'm not responding to you. Oh my God, I'm blocking you. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I didn't lose any sleep. Okay? I didn't. Actually, I slept a little better. So, that ended that. But yet, when I give you the opportunity to try and fix a friendship that you damaged and ruined, you want to say I'm good. Okay, so you're a crackhead, but yet you want to come to me and ask me for money. We're going to pause right there. Morning coffee is so good. Anyway, back to it. You want to ask me for money, but you get pay you got paid today. Actually, you got paid before I did. So why am I even entertaining the thought of sending you money when you get paid before I do on the same day? Hmm. Yeah, I, I put two and two together and I got four. But what you're doing in, in your brain that is having, as Judge Judy would say, a kerfuffle going on. You need to take a, a windshield wiper and some Windex and, and clean your brain out. Thank you, Judge Judy. You're awesome. Um, 
I, I don't understand how people that have these these brain kerfuffles can have two and two, but yet get nine. I, I don't know. But I got two and two and got four. I'm on the outside looking in. I, I know a crackhead's symptoms without you admitting to it. Dude, you're on crack. You can't handle the stress, the drama, and the pressure that you're allowing. So you go to crack. May I ask why? It's okay, don't answer. Mm -mm. No. I'm not waiting either. Mm -mm. As far as I'm concerned, we're no longer friends. At all, period. There is no fixing, there is no rebuilding, there is just no. Okay, I don't know if anybody has seen that video clip I put up some years ago on Instagram. But she says, I can't. Monica, I can't. I've tried, you know what I found out? That I can't. No, 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 I've looked into it and I found out that I can't. I've researched it and I found out that I can't. You know, I'm gonna redo that right quick. And I'm gonna do, I can't. Edward, I can't. I've tried, you know what I found out? That I can't. No, 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 I've given it time and I found out that I can't. I've researched it and I found out that I can't. Okay, and I won't. I will not. I am moving forward. I am moving up by the grace of God. And you are a crackhead. So, like Whitney Houston said, crack is whack. Crack is cheap. I've worked too hard and too long to smoke crack. Crack is whack. No disrespect to Whitney Houston, but you, you see what happened to her. Hey, Amen. Okay. I'm not doing it. I'm not going to play the pity party. I'm not going to in, invest my time and my breath and my energy and anything else having to do with me into a crackhead. Okay? Because I can't. So, Edward... Gray, I'm sorry, um, do, should I address you by your full government or no? Um, I think it's, the IG name is edward.gray5150 or edward.5150, one of those. You know, the display picture is money of which you have very little of. So I'm not bad mouthing you. I'm just saying you have more going out than you have coming in. Anyway. I'm gonna get I'm gonna end this live because I need to go somewhere and cackle real quick. And I'm just going to enjoy my drama free, stress free life. And you can enjoy the crack and your crackhead boyfriend. I'm sorry, the homeless crackhead boyfriend and your I'm going to spend all of your money, disrespect you and emasculate you wife while I'm over here enjoying my home. Okay, my finances, my credit score, and all of my blessings because I'm choosing not to engage with you any further. I can't. I'm not engaging with my ex anymore. I'm not engaging with you anymore. I am not engaging with stupidity anymore. I don't have the energy. Stupidity and ignorance and drama and all of that, it gives me a headache. Okay, and I don't need to have a kerfuffle in my brain. So, in the acts of Tasha K, no fuckery zone, okay? Oh, go check out Tasha K. Um, I love her videos, her content, and her personality. You can find her on Instagram at Unwind with Tasha K. Her content is hilarious. She's also on YouTube, Unwind with Tasha K. No fuckery zone. Um, cause it's fuckery Friday and I'm not here for it. Well, actually, 
<laughs> I am going to be here for it. Yes, I am. I'm going to laugh at it all because it inter- it's entertaining. Mm-hmm. But it's okay because there is no fuckery going on in my life. Okay? Hope you all have a great day. Okay? Because I am. And, you know, laugh at the fuckery. It's funny. Don't engage with it. Just laugh at it because it's hilarious. Okay, gotta go.